All right, so these are different examples of liquefaction at work in the ancient past. Now, keep in mind, this happens periodically from time to time to time, and our modern world is no exception. Uh, we've gone a long time without having these types of cataclysmic events, but they will return. Now, immediately after these cataclysmic events and liquefaction, the world, the surface, becomes a very muddy, swamp-like place, full of quicksand and dangerous. People become caked in mud. You have to imagine people surviving these types of cataclysms and earthquakes and stuff, uh, walking around in this thick mud. I don't know how many people have ever, you know, lived in a place where if it rains even a little bit, uh, especially out in the country or something, that the mud becomes so thick and so sticky that um, you can lose your shoes or your boots just walking around in it, and sometimes it's hard to even get out of it, right? So there's um, this is the rise of the mud people, basically. And this is also poss possibly where the, the story comes from of Adam or the first man being born out of clay or being made out of clay coming up out of the earth after this huge liquefaction event 